Final Fantasy 16 is one of the most hyped up games in 2023. On Twitter, there seems to be a lot of talk about it. If you look at the views of the trailers, they are super high and it wouldn't shock me if a lot of PS5s were sold due to the release of this highly anticipated game. With the game coming out in literally June of this year, it's already been confirmed that Final Fantasy 16 will be ramping up its promotion with potentially new trailers, interviews, and small teases here and there to make us sit there and and speculate what's going to be happening within the game until June of this year. As of right now, there really isn't a roadmap for when we are going to be getting new news and information about Final Fantasy 16. Thanks to a lot of different sources, Reddit, and just speculating all in general, I think I can make what might be a really good prediction for the exact roadmap of when we're going to be getting brand new news and information when it comes towards Final Fantasy 16. Before we get into the video though, I want you guys to take everything I say with a grain of salt. None of this is confirmed, things can change. I'm just trying to bring hype towards the game and just talking about when we are getting more news and information, it's already making someone like me a lot more hyped for this game so please don't use anything that i say within this video as a fact i don't know anything i don't have insider knowledge i am not a reliable source but please at the end of the day this is just me making bold predictions and that's it Secondly, if you guys could just simply leave a like on the video, it really helps the channel out as we are growing right now. We've just hit 500 subscribers recently, and I'm honestly trying to hit 1,000 subscribers very soon. So every little bit does help, and it really means a lot to me if you guys could just simply go down and hit the like button. With that out of the way, let's talk about what we kind of know right now in terms of the trailers that we've currently been getting and the news and information that we've been seeing within Final Fantasy 16. We already have a lot of trailers out there that talk a lot about the story aspects of the game. In fact, there's so many story aspects about the game that we were able to cover a lot of this on the channel. So if you guys didn't see any of these videos, make sure you click the card on the top right. We as a community have gotten far more story oriented trailers right now than there is gameplay. Sure, we have seen gameplay in Final Fantasy 16, but as far as I see it, we haven't seen a lot of gameplay when it comes to Final Fantasy 16. Even when you look at these trailers and their titles, they always talk about something that is happening within the story of the game. And I think we are personally due for a first look gameplay trailer for Final Fantasy 16. It could be IGN, please no, Game Informer or Sony who does this and showcases off the game entirely. There was a Reddit post that I saw recently saying that there was going to be a lengthy trailer around 20 minutes long being shown in March, which is also speculated to have a Sony state of play, which if I'm being honest, I don't think that it would be that long for a Sony state of play. If anything, it's going to be around five minutes long and they will probably post a full 20 minute trailer on YouTube so hopefully we get to see that sometime in March. Uh, editors note, actually, when I recorded this, I did not know this was going to be told. So long story short, there is a brand new state of play that's going to be happening tomorrow at 4 p.m. The official warning says that it's going to be a 15 minute presentation that is going to be featuring Suicide Squad Kill the Justice League, which is also another highly anticipated game to come out. And as well, five PSVR 2 games and a look at some third party partners with in the Sony catalog. Now this doesn't confirm or mean that Final Fantasy 16 is going to be here, but something that does kind of give it away a little bit or could, or you could speculate in some sort of way is that it does say there's going to be third party partners. And if you guys didn't know, Square Enix is a huge third party partner when it comes towards their partnership between Square and Sony themselves. Final Fantasy 16 has a six months claw with PlayStation saying that it's only going to be on the PS5 for the whole year of 2023 meaning that pc players and console players even on xbox wouldn't be able to play this game but i don't know what's going to really happen that's just all it is now let's get right back into the video and speaking about this post they also mentioned a couple of other things like how there's going to be a final fantasy 16 event showcase a demo that's launching in april a big final fantasy 16 event that's going to be happening in Final Fantasy 14 that will also showcase the last big trailer and that is also set to come out near May June with also a couple more smaller promo trailers in June and 
personally, personally, I think some of this is going to be right. And while this rap post doesn't really have a lot of information or claims to back up this like conversation, personally, I think we are going to be getting some of the things that are mentioned here. I think we are going to be getting a demo, but not as early as April. I think it's going to be more of May rather than April. I think we're also going to be getting a big event for Final Fantasy 16, but not as big as Final Fantasy 15's events, because if anybody remembers the literal big event that they hosted way back when, it was a little over the top. I mean, they literally announced a one of four Audi cars for Final Fantasy 15, which I think that was a little too much in my opinion. And I think Square Enix has learned from that mistake because there's no way they're gonna showcase another car for Final Fantasy 16 because I don't even think there's cars in that realm of gameplay. So it would be kind of weird. Now, when it comes to Colossus for Final Fantasy 14, X Final Fantasy 16, it's possible, but I don't see it happening mainly because when it comes to events within Final Fantasy 14, they're normally for IPs that have already come out rather than hyping up IPs that are going to come out. So when we talk about things such as the near raid that happened in Final Fantasy 14 or the Monster Hunter World experience that they had, or even Final Fantasy 15 when it came out, those all came out about a year, maybe a little bit after the game's initial launch release date of that. So I don't really see it happening before the game comes out, but it's not impossible as Yoshi P literally is the producer of Final Fantasy 16 and is also the director of Final Fantasy 14. And I think that there will be some sort of crossover event to happen, but again, I want to say that it's going to happen after 16's launch, but Again, it's a little bit hard for them to do that as there is also the 10 year anniversary for Final Fantasy A Realm Reborn for Final Fantasy 14. So it would be a little bit hard to do a 10 year anniversary plus as well at Final Fantasy 16's launch. And I don't think they wanna do it like too, too late because by some point it will probably die down. The Final Fantasy 16 hype may die down. I definitely think it's gonna be a good game and it's gonna keep people interested for a very long time, but I'm just not 100% sure if they're going to take the risk of releasing the event before or after who knows i certainly don't know but something I, I will say is that i expect from now until june there are going to be a lot of interviews for final fantasy 16. this should literally be a no-brainer as with mostly every trailer that has come out since we have gotten more and more interviews with the producer Yoshi P. I'm excited to see more of that within the future as interviews have always really excited me to see what they're going to talk about and things that they can talk about that weren't really shown in the trailer and have more clarification on, which honestly, really excited. However, guys, I want to ask you this question. When do you think we're going to be getting more news and information on Final Fantasy 16? February is pretty much done. There's only four more months before Final Fantasy 16 is fully released to the world to play. If you are worried about delays, so far the team has said that the game is 90% done and the only thing that they're really working on is ironing out bugs and most likely playtesting the game and seeing what sort of feedback they get from game testers. Which is kind of crazy that now that I really read this because that means somebody is playing through Final Fantasy 16 as we speak, which is also really insane. But without further ado, guys, my name is Adam, also known as V2. I will see you guys in another video. Stay awesome.